Hello guys, welcome. Welcome in a technology welfare. Let's learn and watch with practical in this video tutorial. How to get latest iOS in your iPhone device without data loss. Either your iPhone device recommends to you to update latest iOS or doesn't. But of course you can have latest iOS in your iPhone device. So how do you do that? Let's see. For it guys, firstly, you need to download one tool that is 3U tool. So now see I have opened here and the currently working I'm in uh, here 200, uh, sorry, 312G iOS latest one and uh, this is uh, 16 iOS. Let's see furthermore, and uh, uh, can I have to get the uh, latest iOS? Yes, of course. Uh, so I will tap on a setting. Firstly, I will check it out, iPhone devices are recommending or not. So here, I will tap on a general, tap on a software update, and I will check it out. So it's saying that up to date, and this device is not recommending to have a furthermore update. But of course we can if we would like to or if we want. So how would you do that? For guys, of course, we click on a smart flash and we will go for refresh it. So as we see here, 200, uh, uh, sorry, 312J is a 16 point is officially 3 beta. Let's see here. 300 uh, last three digits see 312 z is a 16 uh, 16 point three beta and here once again we have opportunity to go on a beta 4 that is uh, here 328 h so of course we can add it now So, without losing any data, how do I? So here we have to select these ones, retain user data. So all the data will be remained. Whatever you have, uh, apps, application, photos, anything, uh, especially that should be in your iPhone device, without losing. Then of course, just you have to select a retain user data, and we will go for flash it. So you have an option here to download firstly you will have to download otherwise you can import if you have already downloaded this ipsw or ios from any official website in that situation directly you can import by selection these options but here i have already downloaded this ones from itself is officially i mean tool so just have to go for by clicking on retain user data to flash it so now see it's a thing that you would like to back up no not at all so now see guys here it has just started to especially stacked up so this is all about in this video tutorial furthermore any inquiry related to ios i'm glad you can have the query below the comment box guys thank you thank you very much internet have a great time guys because it will take a time to update for more than 10 minutes so that's why video will be lengthy so this is all about thank you thank you very much indeed have a great time guys